You saw players for Haiti and Canada greeting after the match. So many ties between these two teams. The Haitian team entirely based out of Canada in the Montreal area. A hotly contested matchup won 4-2 by Canada in the end. Canada had never previously made the knockout stage of the CONCACAF Futsal Championships. They were trailing 2-0 for so long after this goal right before the half by Mitchell Sila. In the second half, Canada dominant, controlling possession, controlling the opportunities. Haiti had a few good chances on counterattacks. They were unable to convert any of them. You started to get the sense it might come back to bite them as Canada got closer and closer. Finally, Canada was able to break through. It was Damian Graham who got the goal for the Canadians. He did not play at all in the first half, came in in the second half, does that, makes it two to one. From there, Canada continued to pressure and pressure and pressure until Haiti finally cracked some more. The three points for Canada officially put them through to the knockout stage and mathematically eliminate Haiti. They were so close to their first ever point. Montfort had a chance to make it three to one. Instead, Bennett on the doorstep on the assist from the birthday boy goalkeeper, Joshua Lemos. The tie would have been good enough in all likelihood to get Canada through that last opportunity there from Jean Gilles to make it 3-2 Haiti. The other way it goes, Law gets the goal. The 19 year old for Canada, the game winning goal and they would add a fourth on an empty cage. That'll do it for this matchup between Canada and Haiti. Joe Malva here with you for this one and here with you for the next one. Coming up next, Trinidad and Tobago against Dominican Republic, another match that will likely determine who comes in second in a group and punch a ticket through to the knockout stage, just as Canada did here with a 4-2 win over Haiti. The next match starting at 10 p.m. kick. We'll be back for the pregame in the National Anthems at 9.50 p.m. Eastern time here on CONCACAF.